Hey Sneaky Lens back, quickly again for another quick video for you on Ostromi 2.6.0, yes, just released, nicely nicely. Now Ostromi is from Latvia, as you know, nice Linux distribution, based on Slackware, okay. It says a live CD, but you can install it to a USB stick or your hard drive, it's easy peasy to do either. Basically, it comes with everything you really need to get going, yeah, it does, okay. So, go to my browser over here, get a little thing over there, you can change the themes as well by the way. Go straight to their site, which is all right. Yeah, all right. So I'll just quickly give it that. We go down here, and we go to. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. We have a bit of Googling, and there we are. Okay, so Google UK. And we're going to type in Ostromi. Okay, and see what comes up. We'll go to the wiki, wiki, wiki. Jungle is massive bit, okay. Okay, there we go, 54321, and there we are. And there's the wiki. It's not very big, basically. No, not at all. And most of the site is in Latvian, although there is a bit of English, but it's mainly in Latvian, okay? Now, so I just want to keep that there, for instance, okay? We can just minimise that. And it goes all like that on your desktop, and it's over here in your little widgety bar thing to say what you've got open and what you've not got open. Okay. So you'll say to me, what else can it do? Well, everything. If you really need work done and you're not at your own house and you've got the live CD with you, remember you can get onto a business card CD, stroke DVD, if you really want to. You can get all your work done and upload it to your cloud storage and you're all done. Lovely. We'll minimise that. There you go. So you've got two over there now. Okay. So you can see all the user up here in, in the corner here. So you've got Terminal, Explorer, or spoil your file system. Genie is your text editor. CMonkey is the CMonkey suite, including for Mail and Composium. Skype is a standard. Multimedia, quite a bit in there. Office I've just shown you. A few accessories. Search. Your service says was LX Terminal. Okay, I'll open that for you. There we are. LX Terminal. Lovely. Should we minimise LX Terminal? Yeah, we'll minimise that. Network, desktop, XKill and quit. And you're saying, well, what else have we got? Oh, I'm not going to tell you. Oh, yes, I am. Okay. Left click on the desktop. You get quite a few games, as you can see, all on this small DVD stroke CD. It's only about 250 megs to download, so it's really small. Development, as I said before, you get Genie, Remaster Astronomy. Remember, it's Slackware based, so if you go to G Slack Package Manager, you can download some extra programs, bang them on, and reburn it. And you're saying, Virtual PC on a live CD. Yes, a virtual CD on a live CD. So click it. Yes, you get QEMU for virtualization. Nice. Okay. So I've got all that open at the moment. CPU's not doing anything. Memory's all right. Okay. Under set oh sorry, under graphics, you get Gimpage and Inkscape as well as your PDF document viewer. Under settings, get a few there to change and system information. Under system tools, Conky and G Party to R as standard. Yes. How you stop it all stay with yeah, I didn't thought about one. Install to hard disk drive and install to USB, it's all here, and the task manager again. Under intranet or internet, composer, C Monkey Suite, Linphone is here as well. The Sea Monkey Mail Suite, PW Get for Getting Stuff, Monkey, as I've said before, four times now, Skype, as I've said before, Transmission X Chat, and another chat client that you can use. Okay. If I right click the desktop, you can change Windows and your themes. At the moment, we're using our panel, but you do get quite a few others, including a Cairo dock and a tiling theme. There's a Compage Manager as well there. Set your resolution, set the wallpaper, and your themes hotkeys. So if I have a look, here's how you can change stuff just using the keys. Now, record my desktop is actually in here, but it's only the terminal version. So you may want to put in a bit of GTK there if you want a bit of stuff going down. Okay? Okay. Lovely. Okay. We'll open up. Oh, open up again, sorry. If we go up here, here and here, I'll get rid of that. If we quickly go to the tube, should we go to the tube? Or should we type Google in here? And it won't go where I want it to go, will it? No, we'll go to that one there. So we'll just click there. Silly Billy, silly Billy. Okay. If we go to the tube, in theory, Flash should be installed for you by default. Okay. By default. So I'll quickly go to me, okay? Just to make sure we don't break any laws. And we can watch one of my videos, well, try to, and see what happens. Some rubbish videos on this. Anyway, we'll go to really, really Petit Pois. Let's try Petit Pois. That was quite a, well, not too long ago. When was that? That was July this year. There we go. So we'll wait for it to start up. Five, or three, two, one. Yes, and it starts. Lovely, jubbly. Does what it says on the Latin. Okay. So flash out the box. Nice and do all your stuff. See you later.
So yeah, Ostomi 260, it's just a development version. It's gotten better and better. It's getting stuff sorted and lovely. If you want a nice light distro and you just want to muck about on the live CD without installing it and mucking up your main system, but getting your work done really quickly, this is the baby for you. And just over 250 megabytes, you can't really say no, can you? Otherwise you're being a poo-pooer, isn't you, really? You're pooing the poo-poos, as they do in the poos. What am I going to give it? I like Astromi. This one is no different from the other. I'm going to give it 89%. Next time, I really want to see something new and getting down, though. Really, really new. Be really good. Yeah, nice. Sneaky. And Linux. Out. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.